Hi guys, we are very many days later. <laughs> Sorry. Um, I'm just going to be doing a bit of a clean up with me, like continued. So it'll probably go on the video that I did. I started with this because I've got to get all this sorted. But it, I need to go through drawers because my daughter, she's trashed the living room. So I need to like, go through every box, make sure the toys are in the correct boxes and so on and so forth. Uh, but I can't do it while she's at, at home. There's just no chance. But I'm just sick of living in a crap hole. Well, I'll be honest with you. You know, I keep tidying up like, I mean, I've got my tree down. You know, that's a, that's a start. My decorations are down. That's another start. Woo! Oh, and me, me garlands down. Don't... Isn't it so bare and empty when you take your Christmas decorations out? Or maybe I just go overboard and just put way too many decorations out. But it always feels so depressing because the weather's shit, life's crap, you know. And then your twinkle lights have got to come down. Well, they haven't got to come down, I suppose, but... Probably best they come down. But yeah, so what I'll be doing is I will be showing you me sorting through styles, toys, etc. So on and so forth. So if you're ready for a bit of crap, get a brew. If you want to drink, guys, go get one. And yeah, hopefully we can get quite a lot sorted today. Okay. Yeah, so this is one box and it's supposed to be filled with cars. Paw Patrol vans. Paw Patrol cars. Any sort of cars in here. Car accessories. Car box. However, a fake driving license from Cozy Coop. I, I just feel like everything's everywhere constantly and I just can't get back on top of it. Like, it's so... I'm not saying it's bad, but all I want to do is, you know, chill out, relax, come home, make videos for you guys, which I suppose I'm making videos right now, but edit the videos, because I've got like five videos that need editing, but I haven't got time to edit them because this needs doing. I've got a leak in my bathroom again, and I mean again, look at the expression on my face again, bloody joke. I feel like I need to put my hair up. Just do me, I don't know what I do. No doubt I'll come across some bubbles on it somewhere. That's it. Dirty towels. I'm going to chuck through some of the kitchen. We don't need a meow meow guy. A number five balloon name went down, so she, she busted. So I'm using that as my little carrier bag for now. Pack it. I don't know. Do we keep them? What do we do? I don't know. I hope everyone's doing okay anyway. Oh no, she stuck cakey in there. None of you know who cakey is. It's from a show called Gabby. Gabby's Dollhouse. Got Pillow Cat. I don't know why I'm showing you there. Right, car, car, cars everywhere, everywhere, everywhere. Cleaning set. Woo. Do, 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 do. I'm back. So I have to turn the light on and that and wash my hands, you know. You know how it is. Right, the car's goose there. This wasn't our last prize box, but we're putting that stuff in there, so we could have an empty box, or it could be for like Gabby's dollhouse stuff. I don't quite know. Do all this and then I can clean behind after I've sorted the toys out. So.
you know what? This dolly was like two pound from the pound shop and it's one of her favourite dollies. I mean, she's she looks like she's been dragged through an edge backwards, but she plays with her loads, like loads. A kindy kids stuff goes in here, but again, I don't know where the kindy kids stuff is. That is a great thing, which can go in the bin. So I think I'm going to put this box back because so I've cleared that side because there's no point having it out if not needed. The barber box needs going through. Well, the dolly box. This is all food. I don't I think, actually think she's had anything out of this one for ages. No. for a baby that I don't even know if she has anymore and it could be upstairs but this is the baby box so we'll put it in the baby box that is for a unicorn poopsie thing she doesn't need that keeps holding on to that I shall get rid of it for her I don't know what that's for so I'm going to put that back in that box just in case so we've got that just clean down here Right, so that's the food box. So we've done three. Done. Right, that's a Lego. Oh, puzzles, Lego. Pieces are in there. Right, there's a play mobile set somewhere that needs to go in there. However, I've lost it again. Did I ever have it? That is the question. I wish you'd get rid of this. Oi. Baby toy caterpillar that you chase round. By saying something stupid like I love you This is Paul Patrol on a roll Mixed with Barbies so it shouldn't be in there Well they aren't Barbies, I don't know what this is called Does any of you remember this fecky that got stuck behind the dishwasher? So many toys everywhere. I don't know how to keep going. I don't know whether to put these Gujitsus in this baby box. I think that's a good plan. Gujitsus and babies. That's for that box, but that helps me sort it. But we can put this one back in. Right, that is currently a Paw Patrol box. <clears throat> However, I don't know where anything else is. That back for now. Right, so we've done, done apart from that one. And then there's these three boxes left. So, get the barbs out. Also, we've got Jasmine, Cinderella, Aurora, Val, Moana. She's got two Moanas. There's one sings. 
No, I can't stop it singing. Sorry about that, guys. There's normal Moana. She likes putting all these like crowns and everything on her dolls. Now we've got Pocahontas, Mulan, another Elsa. Merida and then got some like Barbies now so Barbies put them in the box another Barbie and we've got Shimmer and Shine Genies Divine Snow White more Barbies I'm going to say yeah, this box is like filled with accessories and there's like even more I don't know where that's from Do you ever like, look at your daughter's toys and go where did she even have that from? I do that all the time That was a one out of a Barbie thing so I know that's a Barbie one <clears throat> Just pick up all these tiny accessories. That was part of one of the outfits you got for the Barbie. Accessories that doesn't shot. With scales name on. Right now we can get. Do you know what? There's always a shoe in there. Right, put all these Rapunzel. There you go. Right, these are these little mini dolls that she really wanted them other ones for. Barbie. Don't know how to put that in there as well. It's a mermaid star. Yeah. Oh no. Tuck, tuck your tail down there, you'll be alright. Do this one next. Which is the miscellaneous box. I don't know how if I said that correctly, but I'm sure someone will tell me if I don't. Literally, just a load of random crap. <sighs> so, this is basically where I could sort it, but I probably wouldn't have enough room to sort it out into. So, it goes back into the box. That's a little car thing in there. So we've got a pony, that's what she had from the charity shop that time, if you all remember. We've got a fingerling. One of them Celeste pony things. A random horsey. Sally. Well, these are the dapper ones. Mr. Socko. Baby, horses, horses, Sonic the Hedgehog, Holly from Ben and Holly, she attempted to draw Jack somehow, what one of her best friends gave her so they'd been going to school together since preschool and then she left to like move house somewhere else 
So the, she gave her these and she absolutely cherishes the crap out of them. Again, just more, more crap. Twilight Sparkle. Dolly box. That is for a buy, but she keeps it in a toy box as usual for these kids. As Ben. Gotta catch them all. I know it's my destiny. Fucking you my, you're my best friend. Cider. You teach me, I teach you, Pokemon. a medal for when she went on the Gruffalo ride.
arts and craft ones, guys. Play-Dohs aren't even the right colours anymore. Activity book, quiz and game book. Search and find. Activity, activity, link and go. Search and find. Well, these books say. So that guys, that's those draw sorted. Now I've got to do all them. The reason I'm sorting the drawers out first is because if I sort all the drawers out, then I know where everything's got to go and where I need to put things, if that makes sense. I'm thinking for now, put these Gabby's Dolls House things in this box because they're actually everywhere.
Ayan ito pa. Hey guys, um, just a quick update. I haven't really got around to doing much, um, but we're about halfway through the living room. Yay! I'll update you in a bit again. Hey guys, welcome back. So guys, oh, I um. I'd like to say finish the living room. I'll give you a quick show. Um, yeah, this has taken me about probably three, four days to complete. I've only got to sort of pull out the princess castle in the TV unit now, because I like making sure every nook and cranny is being cleaned and everything else. This, this ignore the kitchen, That that is, that is a later problem. Look at my thumb. I've got an infected thumb. I need to go to a walk-in over it, but I haven't got time to go to a walk-in over it. Um, no, I think we're going pop-up later. I've had the council out to, I don't know if which video I've explained to you, but I've had a leak in my bathroom. Again, sorry, I'm just thinking it's, it's more steady. There we go. Yes, yeah, so I've had a leak in the bathroom again except not through the ceiling into my kitchen, through my seat, through the roof into, well, the loft into the ceiling. So basically, there'd been moisture there, which I didn't click in, but it was, there was a load of damp on that wall. Now, obviously I've had the brand new bathroom fitted and replaced, um, but they've put in an extractor fan. Now they've needed to climb all the way around so they could put the wires and everything into the wall and stuff. Which is fair enough. However, they've either knocked it or seen that it needs removing and gone, oh, we'll just leave it because it's not causing any issues. Not realising that it was causing issues and it was actually dripping into my ceiling. So uh, I had a poor chap come out last night who basically was like, yeah, the pipe that they've left in is from a very old, like, water tank that probably hasn't been in the house for, like, God knows how many years. Well, we've lived in the house how many years ourselves. And I know people who used to live here before, which they also didn't have a water boiler. So it's been there for a while. And, um, yeah, basically it's been slowly dripping into my ceiling, causing a flood in my bathroom. However, what doesn't help is I've also got a leak in my toilet. But the guy was like, well, I can't fix that tonight because he came, like, really late last night. Um, so you'll either have to call it out and I'll put it on notes so someone should contact you. I've not had anyone contact me and every time I try to phone them, it just keeps going boop, boop, boop. So that's when I can get through again. Um, try and think what else has gone on for you. Don't think anything else has gone on as of now. 
but yeah I may go and end this video here guys because it's, it's been a long one a very long one and I've got cut it off somewhere and as you can see you know it's pretty relatively tidy you know I've done a good job ish but yeah I hope you enjoyed this video guys and I will see you in the next one hopefully bye